Well, we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna oh, call for John and order a new set of wheels real fast. Uh, these are now gone. Now they'll be fine. They're packaged. There's there's a lot of foam in there. Whatever. This is Chief Keef's new wheels. You guys saw his Urus done previously. We told you the wheels were not ready. These are his new wheels. These are more designed for this vehicle in particular. Uh, so we're gonna put that on right now and finish it up. It's a crazy busy day here today. It's hot. I am wearing my RDB shoes, of course, but yeah, let's get to work. Moses! Help me, idiot! <laughs> oh my god, how's this car gonna drive with these wheels? It's the world's heaviest wheels. Uh, hold on. <laughs> You're off, I think. Hold on, go back. Keep going. Yeah, right there, right there. Holy shit, they're heavy. Oh. I died. I think my left arm is I think I have an arm. Right here behind me on the lift is this beautiful 2020 Rolls Royce Cullinan. Black badge edition, this is not a regular one. This is a special color from Rolls Royce, it's called Burnout Gray. Kind of like the Nardo Gray, looks really nice. This car comes with black plastic underneath the car, sort of like this, but this is actually black as well. The back bumper, the front lower bumper is all black plastic. So all this stuff was sanded, uh, smoothened out, and turned into paint. So we painted it Burnout Gray, it all matches. This thing is black and gray. It's actually gonna get 26 inch RDB wheels next. Also, uh, there's a f Armenian man over there and uh, he sucks at what he does. Oh, <laughs> I like it this way because it's like old fashioned. It's like right here. What if somebody steals my phone or I lose the phone? What's gonna happen? iCloud. I, yeah, this is better. <laughs> nice ass box. If you want to drag that joint, you're just crazy. Good quality. Yup. Yeah. Crazy. Yeah. Amazing quality, man. This is a beautiful shoe. Looks designer. Yes, sir. And the uh, really carbon fiber, right? Yeah, yeah. Another size 10. The ones you like too. They come with extra laces. Yeah. And they come with the shoehorn and they come with shoe bag. A lot of box. Yeah, bro. Like, it doesn't. This is like the VIP box. Oh, yeah. So I have regular, regular box and Yeah. Yeah. Regular box, box is tied too. It's all little RDBs inside. So we're over here at our buddy store, Cool Kicks. Rolls Royce next to me. My ears over there. Uh, we brought over two pairs of RDB shoes here: the white and the asphalt. First place to have them is here. They're not gonna sell them, they're gonna have it for display only. Really dope, really one of the best sneaker stores in Los Angeles, if not United States. And we're proud to have RDB shoes here right now. G550, brand 
brand new customer hit me up he said he got the car over the weekend he needed wheels desperately asked me what i got we got the rdb wheels in stock he came by right away 24 inch three-piece rdb wheels floating cap of course car other than that is stock he has some other plans for it. We're gonna be removing the front guard, which is the best thing to do on the 550s. Just like the previous episode, you guys saw the white one came out amazing. That was also a G550. If you guys wanna order, hit us up directly. Doesn't matter where you are. We're gonna be growing the RDB Wheels brand tremendously. New styles are coming up. We're gonna be also tweaking up the RDB Wheel a little bit, the original one, to make it even nicer. So contact us if you wanna get wheels on your car. guys Cullinan is finished up here basically we have a little more tweaks to do we are still adjusting the suspension on it this is sitting on 26 inch wheels so it's very sensitive the suspension on this car we want to lower it a little bit not too much test drive it make sure it's not too bouncy and keep adjusting it right now everything's going very well the back needs to come down a tad bit more we don't have enough time today to finish that up we're gonna be doing that tomorrow sitting on 26 inch RDB wheels with floating caps really really crazy setup again burnout gray Rolls-Royce cullen in everything on the body is pretty much stock the grill all that stuff we just painted all the plastic trims on the car, which are hideous on the Cullinan. If you have a Cullinan, you gotta get rid of that plastic underneath the car. Literally, the first thing I would do on a Cullinan is that. This is the black badge, so it's got that amazing interior. This is not a regular Cullinan, guys. This is a black badge. We have a lot of big builds coming up. Stay tuned. All right, guys, we're standing here with Chief Keef Zuris. Uh, unfortunately, we did not finish up this beast because we got the wheels a little bit late and uh, mounting the tires on this car is a pain in the ass. Uh, 24 inch, obviously, on the Urus, like mine, same tires as my car. The front are on, the back we are actually having some trouble getting air into the tires and sealing up. Remember, the back tires on this are 355, 25, 24. Really crazy wide and the diameter is big. So it's not only the width, it's the height too. Very, very difficult to put on a three-piece wheel like this. But yeah, here you see the front wheel right there, Ford Auto. Crazy yellow and black setup. Three-piece, of course. Yellow is matching the wrap. So literally, this was all done according to the yellow and black theme. Forged carbon fiber everywhere. We're super excited about this Urus. Unfortunately, we didn't get it done for you guys on this episode, but next episode, you guys are gonna see us deliver this thing to Sosa. It's gonna be done, stanced up and everything with that deep dish back wheel. This is gonna look insane when we're finished. So we're back here with this Maybach that we built a few months ago. This went viral on the internet for a few reasons. One, this is not a newer Maybach. This is a 1617 Maybach. So this still has the older style headlights older style wheels, all that kind of stuff. We spiced things up, we upgraded everything on this vehicle, it has starlight inside, we upgraded the entire front end of this vehicle, we put RDB wheels on there with Maybach center caps, so really upgraded this car tremendously. This is actually an aftermarket headlight. This is the 2019 version style of a Maybach, but it is aftermarket, so we don't have the orange, um, and this thing has really dope LED effects going on. Obviously the bumper was changed, the front grille, all that stuff was changed to make it look like a 2019 and honestly it looks gorgeous on my other side we actually do have a 2019 Maybach this is a genuine 2019 Maybach stock nothing modded on it yet um, as you can see there's chrome everywhere it has the orange side marker right there this doesn't so really dope to see these two together where if you spend a little bit you can make your older car look as good if not better as a new one uh, this car is actually going to be a complete project as well we're going to be wrapping it a very very custom dope color so we're excited to show you guys this next but yeah let us know if they were the same year which car you would choose <laughs> 